Yo, secret of Steph Curry's ball handling finally revealed. Finally get the up close footage on his handle and see how he handles the ball with his left hand, which tells a lot about how he picks the ball up going into his shot, going into his pass, and explains how why everything he does is so crisp and kind of explains the way that he moves. So if you check the rotation of the ball with his left hand, you can see that he keeps the ball on the seams and goes out of his way to do that. Um, why would you want to keep the ball on your seams on your left hand? Uh, you can pick up the ball with the other hand on the right hand on the seams, ready to shoot or pass on the seams. Uh, we've been looking at some other point guards, Patrick Beverly, uh, Jeff Teague, Brandon Knight. Brandon Knight is similar to Steph, but other guards dribble not on the seams, but on the ends. And that works too, because you can pick up the ball from the end as well. But the point is that there's a certain level of crispness in the handle that is more to how high am I dribbling, where am I dribbling, Am I dribbling on seams? And what that does is just allows you to pick up the ball in your exact perfect way every time. Um, you notice that when you go to the free throw line, what's most comfortable is to line your index or middle finger up to the middle of the ball. Whatever you do, just to set it. And this lets you always be able to pick up the ball every time in that way. So that is gonna improve your shot. It's gonna improve your pass two shooters. It can also improve your dunking because if you may have noticed, if you're working on palming the ball, that it's easiest from the grooves covering two ball panels if your hand's big enough. That oh, makes your hand bigger, essentially. So if you can dribble on the seams, you can pick up the ball on the seams, giving you a better grip as well. So there's lots of benefits to this, and it really takes the high-def footage to see it. And I'm glad that we had this capture at All-Star Weekend because it, I think, will help a lot of guards come up to Steph Curry's level or try to at least get a better idea. Um, again, if you want to learn this, recommend practicing in front of a mirror. Seems to be a really fast way to do it. And just work on the dribbling on the seams or dribbling on the ends and picking up the ball on the seams from the seams or the ends. So it's just an extra little element to pay attention to in your handles. So hope this helps. Good luck. Let me know what else you want to see a breakdown of. Peace.